Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. My name is Parker, so this video is going to be insane. I've got loads to talk about anywhere from new secret skins coming in the future in Fortnite Season 4 and what we know all about Fortnite Season 3 and how it's going to lead into Fortnite Season 4. So if you're excited for this video, be sure to drop a like down below and click subscribe if you're new here. I really appreciate all the support lately. We are so close to a thousand subscribers, guys. We are 50 away. Every single one helps, so I really appreciate it. And guys, please stick around till the end of the video. I do have an announcement to make that'll talk about the future of my channel and what's to happen. So please, guys, listen to that at the end of this video. So jumping right into it, you guys can see we've got all the Batman gear back in the store with the Harley Quinn outfit, the Batwoman, and the gliders. Everything, pretty much the entire shop is all Batman stuff, so pretty awesome. But guys, this is not all related to Batman that's going to be in this store. This coming November, which I know it's quite a while away, it's a few months away, Fortnite actually posted yesterday this Joker bundle. That is right, guys. Joker is going to be in the game along with Poison Ivy, which looks pretty awesome. I, I'd say the Joker skin is like pretty fire. Honestly, I might buy this thing. It is going to be $30, so it's pretty expensive, but it does include all these skins and I believe backlings, pickaxes, gliders, plus a thousand additional V-Bucks. So if you add it up, I'm pretty sure it's definitely going to be worth it. So totally up to you. I will definitely think about it. But guys, look at the right side. Who is that? That is Midas. And we thought Midas was dead at the start of this new chapter because he got, well, he got eaten by a shark. So, I mean, everyone thought he was dead. But no, he is returning. And you can see it's called the Midas Rex outfit. Like, I have no clue what this means. His outfit actually looks insane. And what's really cool about it, if you zoom in on his chest piece, that little crown that's upside down is the exact same crown that the Oro skin is wearing. And this Oro skin has definitely had a huge part in the Fortnite seasons. But I'm not really sure what their plan is in the future, but they definitely are returning and they're going to do something huge. So at the beginning of this new season, we did get the Siona skin, which is like a space outfit skin with different styles. And as this season went along, their spaceship appeared underwater when the map was flooded. And as the levels were dropping, the spaceship finally appeared and you were able to do a couple challenges and it did shoot off into the sky and there were a couple rifts around that did just last for a couple minutes and guys a couple videos back i did talk about rifts making a return so go ahead and check out that video there's a card on the screen right here as i'm recording this video the dio skin finally came out this is the male counterpart to the siona skin looking pretty fire and Fortnite did release another image with both of them together on their spaceship. Looks pretty awesome. So yeah, you guys can go ahead and pick up this whole bundle. It's got the back bling. Then you can also get a new glider, the star cross, which looks pretty fire. And then the homescape wrap, which is also pretty awesome looking. Just recently in this season, there is a secret spot in steamy stacks underground in this specific building you have to go here break a floor go down these stairs there's still nothing there then you have to break another wall and then you find this odd orange briefcase with this little triangle stone on top of it and right before you get near this stone the music starts to play and people were very confused about this but it's definitely going to be a crossover to a new movie and what is that movie well it's going to be tenet which is a new movie that just recently came out so it looks like Fortnite is going to be doing a crossover very soon, most likely in the next season, so stay tuned for that. And of course, people have been talking about the Thor skin coming in the next season. I myself did mention this in another video, so go check that out. And Fortnite did release a skin that looked like Fat Thor from the Endgame movie, and what's also really cool about it in the Endgame movie is he was actually playing Fortnite in the movie, so obviously they're doing another crossover, so stay tuned for a Thor skin coming very soon in Fortnite. Now the crazy part, guys, this leaked skin is gonna blow your mind. No one else knows about this except for a few more people on Twitter. So thank you to Hypex for giving this information out to everyone. It says possible leak. Epic, we're planning to make a Wolverine skin and Wolverine claws pickaxe. He might be the season four secret skin or just an item shop skin. This is from a very trusted source. Okay, so there you guys have it. A Wolverine skin coming very soon to Fortnite. Like he said, it could be the secret skin, but I was also thinking the Thor skin could be the secret skin for the next season. So who knows, but we're definitely gonna be getting all these different skins. Because Fortnite definitely does like to do crossovers with Marvel and DC, as you guys can see right now. The whole shop is filled with DC characters. 
so it's pretty awesome. And of course, as this season comes to an end, there's going to be a live event, and that is going to be in the form of the High Tower live event, and that'll be occurring this Saturday, most likely, if the season doesn't get delayed, cross our fingers, please hopefully it doesn't. There is no information about this High Tower live event yet. It's most likely going to be occurring this Saturday, like live events usually do on the Saturday before the launch of the new season, which will be on August 27th. If you guys are excited for the new season and all the new secret skins to come out, be sure to drop a like on this video and please subscribe. So guys, now on to the part where I was mentioning in the beginning of this video, a couple announcements I have to make. So this video is going to be my last video. Hold on, <laughs> it's not my final last video, but I've been on summer for a few months now. Obviously school ended and then it was partly online at the end of last year due to COVID. And, you know, during summer, I have loads of time to make videos, definitely a lot easier to make them. And now as school is starting, pretty much tomorrow is when I go back. It's all 100% online, so I will be at home. I'm hoping to still be able to record videos, maybe not throughout the week. It really just depends on my homework and everything like that. But I will definitely try and get videos out on the weekend. So please subscribe, guys, and turn on notifications because I'm sorry I cannot give you like a upload schedule because of... I really don't know what my schedule is going to be like with school. It seems it's not going to be as difficult because classes are going to be a lot shorter throughout the day, so I'm going to have more time to myself. So hopefully I can get all my work done and be able to put out more videos for you guys. And also, I am almost at a thousand subscribers, like I've said in almost every single video, and I really appreciate every single one of you guys. You really mean the world to me, and I will be doing a giveaway at a thousand subscribers in return for you guys. And when I do reach a thousand subscribers, I will be able to get a support a creator code in the Fortnite item shop, which I am super excited about. I have wanted one ever since this system came out and I've been so jealous of all the other YouTubers. So I am really excited for that. And guys, I will tell you what that code is when I do reach a thousand subscribers and be sure to pop it in and support me as a content creator. Guys, that's going to wrap up the video. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys soon.